Hi, this is room 112. It's day 21. Um, our son's here. We're here. Everything's going to be okay. Just wanted to tell you um, it's Jackie Robinson Day, and um, we just wanted to say everything's going to be okay. Now, having said it's Jackie Robinson Day, what does that mean, and what are we going to learn about today? Well, the clue was in the thing that I said, Jackie Robinson. Who is Jackie Robinson? Let's go in and find out a little bit about him. I'll shut the door. We already got the mail. It's been 73 years since Jackie Robinson integrated baseball. He was the first African-American player to play in baseball. So, and then, oh, there you go. Wait a second. You talk about... Baseball of, it's a, in a different language, it's in Spanish. Baseball in, of Puerto Rico. And there is the Puerto Rican flag. Puerto Rico is a territory, but it also has its own flag. And it was one of the first leagues where African Americans could play in the, in the pros. And that's what brought us in today's lesson. The baseball of Puerto Rico, the Puerto Rico, Rican Baseball League was founded in 1938. And um, in Puerto Rico, here's the flag, Puerto Rico has as its capital San Juan. And there's uh, five teams in the Puerto Rican Baseball League, and they play baseball from November 13th all the way through January. And they played 36 regular season games. In the past, they used to play 40. And the, see, there's five teams here. And the top three teams go on to the a round robin 18 game playoff. And after that, the top two teams play out for the league championship. And the winner goes to the Caribbean World Series. Oh, wait, Caribbean or Caribbean? Hmm, a little pondering. You could pronounce it either way. But it, they go to the Caribbean World Series. Now, um, the LBPRC. The League of uh, Baseball of the Puerto Rican uh, has 16, has won the Caribbean title 16 times. And that's second to the Dominican Republic. Now, if I wanted to go see a baseball game in Puerto Rico, I would pay six bucks for a ticket. Um, one of the little trivias, we went outside today, and until 1993, all the games were played on natural grass. And now they have one stadium that they have artificial turf. Uh, when you're playing baseball, Jackie Robinson. Jackie Robinson was number 42. Nobody in the major leagues can have the number 42 because they retired his number. In the Puerto Rican Baseball League, the number 21 has been retired. And that's Roberto Clemente, the most famous player that's played in Puerto Rico. Um, this t-shirt, you're like, oh, this is kind of a cool t-shirt. I got this from my wife, and it's from Everett's Fields Flannel. Not, not a new commercial endorsement. But anyway, they talk about famous uh, baseball leagues from the, or teams from the past. And this shirt, this league, uh, represented from the, the league in 1956. And that's when Willie Mays and Roberto Clemente were both teammates. Willie Mays had just won the, his MVP award, and Roberto Clemente was his first years in the pros. Uh, one of the little trivia facts about the base, uh, Puerto Rican Baseball League is that there's 50 members that once played, uh, 50 players who once played in the Puerto Rican Baseball League who are in the Hall of Fame. And like I said, uh, it was Roberto Clemente, uh, uh, Willie Mays in this league. But, and then why did I talk about, how did I tie in? I'm talking excited because I'm like, ah, it's baseball. But uh, why did I tie, tie in Jackie Robinson? And it's because uh, a lot of the players from the Negro Leagues played in uh, Puerto Rican baseball, and they could, play, they could play with white people, they could play with Hispanic people. And uh, some of the members were Buck Leonard, um, Josh Gibson, Satchel Page, but other players that, were, that, were, that played baseball when it was integrated have been Bob Gibson, Hank Aaron, Reggie Jackson, one of my favorite players from the Cubs, Fergie Jenkins, um, uh, one of the, my, my, I have a friend who, Mr. W, who, uh, loves the White Sox. He teaches at Kennedy and Juan Pizarro, who was a White Sox and a Cub 
played down in the Puerto Rican league. Um, uh, Juan Pizarro also pitched a no hitter in the when he was in the Puerto Rican baseball league. Um, I talked about Willie Mays and Roberto Clemente, and they had an awesome team that year. They won the Puerto Rican uh, baseball league championship, but. Neither one of those players won the MVP. The winner of the MVP that year, Tom Lasorda, who was a shortstop. He won over all those guys in 1955. So uh, one of those little trivia facts about that, they've only canceled baseball in Puerto Rico twice. They had a shortened season due, due to the recent hurricane. And then one, league, one year, they, the league had financial troubles and they, they didn't get to play. So... Um, that's kind of one of the little trivia facts about that. Um, my wife says, hey, you got this shirt for a present. Why don't you talk to him about the All-Star game? And yes, the Puerto Rican um, Baseball League used to go halfway through. Like we said, we started in November. But in December, they would play an All-Star game, and all the profits would go to Three Kings Day. And that's how in Latin America they celebrate uh, Christmas. They call it Three Kings Day. And uh, they used to have all the, the money. They would collect all the money and give it to uh, children who were in need there. So one of our little trivia facts for today on Jackie Robinson Day, uh, Puerto Rican Baseball League, uh, one of the first natural, nation, naturally integrated baseball leagues. Players from The best players from around the world would, would play there, like we said. It was an exciting baseball, and it gave the people in Latin America uh, just a chance to like show their national pride. In fact, one of the um, the best stadiums in Latin America is from the Puerto Rican Baseball League, and that's been the the um, the site of the World Baseball Classics, where countries from other all around the world go to uh, Puerto Rico and play the the uh, World Championship. So, just a little trivia about that. We will talk a little bit later about. Uh, the territory of Puerto Rico. So that's kind of a little teaser. Later on, we will talk about Puerto Rico. And uh, we'll have a little bit more information about Jackie Robinson, who is a, a star player, a pioneer, and, and truly a, a hero. Uh, but for today, um, just wanted to say hola, a couple words in Spanish, and say uh, I hope you have a good day. Just wanted to let you know that we're here. We're going to continue to be here. Everything's going to be okay. Our sons are there. And maybe if we were like Ernie Banks, we could play too. Um, take care and have a good day. All right, bye.